For years, when it came to cybersecurity, many people were under the impression that hackers were only after large corporations. But in 2021, as 50% of cyber attacks now target small businesses, the House recently passed two bills to help the leaders of these organizations readdress their cybersecurity infrastructures. We'll take a look at the details of each pending legislation as we sit down and sync up with Rocket IT's weekly technology update. Hello everyone, I'm Chris Winston, Technology Insider here at Rocket IT, and welcome to another episode of Sync Up, your new home for trending technology news. Late last week, the House approved two bills to help improve the cybersecurity of small businesses. The first comes in the form of the Small Business Administration Cybersecurity Awareness Act, and while it does not directly impact the cybersecurity strategy of organizations like the second bill we'll talk about shortly, it does make government agencies more accountable for the security of the data it stores on behalf of small businesses. In particular, the Cyber Awareness Act requires the Small Business Administration to publicly report its cybersecurity capabilities and notify Congress of breaches. Details of these reports would include information regarding the SBA's cybersecurity infrastructure, improvement strategies it has for cybersecurity, and details surrounding its use of technologies manufactured by foreign countries. As for the mandate to report breaches, this request stems from an incident back in April where over 8,000 small businesses applying for the SBA's Economic Injury Disaster Loan Program had their information exposed online. For those thinking that this act sounds familiar, it was passed by the House back in 2019 but never made it through the Senate. Now, as the pending legislation passed by a vote of 400 23 to 0 in the House, the likelihood of it becoming a law is quite high. In addition to this first bill, the House also passed the Small Business Development Center Cyber Training Act. First introduced back in July, the goal of this legislation is to provide small businesses with the resources and expertise to combat cyber attacks. Currently, if a business owner were to call their local small business development center, it's unlikely they receive much insight on cybersecurity trends and best practices. While still pending a vote from the Senate, this legislation hopes to create a cyber counseling certification program at small business development centers across the United States. Through this certification program, each SBDC would be reimbursed up to $350,000 as they train employees to become experts on the cybersecurity field. In turn, the goal is to give small businesses the upper hand and provide leaders with a resource to help develop better cybersecurity strategies. But although the passing of these bills is a step in the right direction, training SBDC staff is bound to take some time. And knowing that this is a free and highly sought government resource, business leaders should be ready to experience lengthy wait times upon requests. In turn, for organizations that need immediate help when it comes to cybersecurity, I encourage you to give Rocket IT a call at 770-441-2520. With quick response times and security experts on hand, our team is here to help you navigate even the most challenging of security issues. In the meantime, to stay up to date on trending technology news, hit that subscribe button and the bell to catch us on next week's episode of Sync Up with Rocket IT.